Yo, hello guys and welcome back again to a brand new video. In today's tutorial guys, I will be showing you how to go to definition in Visual Studio Code. So, first of all guys, I will show you now how to get Visual Studio Code in the first place, which is a pretty simple thing. Just go ahead and open your browser, it doesn't matter if it is Google Chrome, Firefox or what it is, whatever it is, just go and open your browser and then through the URL section, search for code.visualstudio.com. If it doesn't work for you, just go ahead and search for Visual Studio Code, which is simple. Then click on the first link that will appear for you, which is this one. Now, to be able to download it for Windows, you just have to click here. If you want to download for other platforms or other operation system, you can just click on this arrow over here, and this list will be dragged for you. You can download it for Mac OS, Stable Insiders, Windows Stable Insiders, and Linux Stable Insiders. Of course, there's other download ways, and you can open it as well in your browser. So, and guys, I will leave you the side notes so you don't make the same mistake that I've made in the first time I downloaded this software. When I tried to download Visual Studio Code for the first time, I didn't actually download Visual Studio Code. I installed the other software, which is Visual Studio. They look so similar beside the color of the logo, and their names are so close to each other because this one is Visual Studio and this one is Visual Studio Code. So the first time I downloaded this, I thought it was this one, but no. So make sure that you are on the bluish logo. Now guys, after you're done with that, what you need to do is go ahead and open your uh, Visual Studio and then go to your code. As you can see here, this is my code on HTML. So how we can use the go to definition uh, system or, uh, or function, it is pretty simple. Go to your code and go to whatever line you want to go and make sure that this line has already been waiting a lot of time. For example, in my case, if I went here, go to definition, there is no definition found for HTML. So basically, just make sure that you have, have it like declared somewhere else. Now click here, go to definition and it's like so you have used this go to the definition function in Visual Studio Code. So guys, that's how you can use you go to the finishing in Visual Studio Code. So thank you guys for watching and see you in the next tutorial.